What's up, Tasha? What are you doing here? Getting rigged up for fishing tomorrow, and I've heard through social media, particularly Instagram, that there are giant oh monster God. snooks chewing on top waters this time of the year. Summer is red hot for them. We are gonna head to Jupiter, Florida. That's where they're at. It's gonna be awesome, guys. So we're gonna go up to Jupiter. We're gonna take our own boat, catch our own fish, unlike maybe some other folks don't do who maybe don't have a boat and go with charter captains all the time. We're gonna show you the real deal. And be sure to stay tuned until the end of the video because assuming we catch some fish and I think we're gonna catch some big lunkers. Oh my gosh. Let's room. Uh, we're gonna do a tackle time for you and tell you exactly what we caught the fish on. And uh, so stay tuned for that, and we'll see you in the morning. Oh my gosh, hooked up this morning, guys. Oh no, oh no, no. Come on, come on, big boy, out of the structure. No, no, no. Dude, you might have to go over there. Hang on, can't talk. I think I got him out. I got him out. Oh my gosh. That was a brutal fight this morning. Starting off the day, guys. We are in Jupiter, Florida today. It's dead quiet this morning. We are top water fishing here in the summertime. I've got a stud fish on. Let's see what we got. Heck yeah. Way to crush it first thing in the morning like this. Oh god. Big snook. Love it. Love it, dude. Oh my gosh, it's a freaking giant. Oh my gosh. Oh. That happens. That was a beautiful snook though. She just head shook. She shook about 10 times there towards the end. This leader is all frayed up. She just crushed that Yuzuri hydro pencil. We're gonna toss this right back out and get another giant. I have a good feeling. That was sick. Jeez, guys, she caught a fish before I, I could even get the camera out. <laughs> Sorry, that was, might have been a little foggy, a little messed up. I didn't net that fish. But if you're new to the channel, that's Darcy, also known as Darcyzzle. I'm Brian, and we're a fishing couple. And uh, basically, we quit our jobs like three, four years ago to pursue our dreams, fishing and filming this show for you guys. Our motto is Fish Dream Inspire, hopefully inspiring some of you guys to leave your dreams too. Darcy's going to catch us another fish here real soon. Running me into the bridge. Running me into the bridge. Running me into the bridge. I'm in the bridge. I gotta use up your leader. Come on, fishy. Come, come on, back, fishy. Come back get here. Out. I think you got him out now. Definitely felt the wall. Oh my gosh, second top water bite this morning. Guys, this is a huge fish. A no joke fish. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, no, 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 no! Oh no, I'm gonna lose it. I'm on the bridge. I'm on the bridge, you're gonna break. Baby, 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 baby. Come back here and free spool it. Why are you, what are you doing? I'm trying to drop it. Going all the way to you right now. Running, 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 running. Watch your rods. We break off, we break off. Do this way, all the way out. I'm holding the rod. I got the rod. Got it? Let go? Yeah. What? Baby! It's done, it's done. It's broke. Mother! All right, that turned into a big mess. It was like half dark. The fish got wrapped around the bridge and I, I we almost dropped, I dropped the rod in the water. It was a big deal. So I retying. She's a little mad right now. And, so is he. <laughs> <laughs> no, now the light's up, we actually see what's going on and hopefully we'll land one. But it's tough in the bridge with a 40 inch snook. That was a monster. Oh, 
my god. Oh my god. Did you see that bitch? That was a monster snook. Insanely massive. I'm just drifting back my top water again over him. What's up guys, I got a snook on, I think, on the, uh, what the hell am I using? Flare hawk. He's coming in quick. Get the net, get the net. Okay, I got to put down this camera. I understand, get the net. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh my, my god, god, dude! Get him in the boat. This monster in the boat! Oh my god! <laughs> Ryan just killed it, it's on, it's on, camera's on. The sun didn't die yet. I just landed Ryan's fish! Oh my gosh! Measure him. That is a snook and a half, heavy. dude! Heavy, heavy! What an insane catch! On his bait caster, no less. This is a 40 all day. No. No way. That is a fat 38. Oh, look at it. Look at the curve. Look at the mess. Look at that same fish. Wow. Let's get her back in the water. Quick pick and get back in the water. I think I snagged her. Mm -hmm. Or she ate it and it got snagged. Yeah, probably. Giant monster snook going home. Just one more look at the beast. Look at her girth, she's insane, insane fish. She even has an old bite mark right here. Oh boy, she's ready. You see that, when they're biting onto you and they don't let go, that, mean that, that means that fish is ready. So as soon as she lets go of my thumb, let go, you can't take my finger with you. You can't take my finger. There she goes. Beautiful. That was so sick. Big 38, two giants on top waters this morning. Let's go get some more guys. Awesome job by putting today. Let me give you a little debrief on that. Let me turn off my trolling motor. Now it's starting to get a little hot out and the tide died, okay? So I put on a flare hawk, which is a pretty common bait. And cause I thought the fish might be deeper. Uh, that's where the big ones hang out. So I, I was using the flare hawk on the bottom. Darcy's using the uh, top water on top. So we're covering the water column like a good team. And uh, that fish stumped and then something happened. I guess he turned around or something. He kind of got, got it jabbed in the side, uh, but whatever. Uh, that, that's gills. fishing. No, it wasn't the gills or nothing, just jabbed in the side. But, uh, you know, fishing, weird things happen underwater you don't know. So uh, that's, a, that's the technique. Uh, you know, I'll put that on the fish angler about where we caught that fish. Check out that app. It's one of Darcy's great new sponsors. has the weather on there and people can log their fishes. And you can see, most importantly, other people log their fishes. So you see a lot of fishes. All right, let's get some more. On. Quick. Putting on another one. Other side. Oh my gosh! Ah! Monster dude, monster on the bait caster. We could put and slay in it. Oh my gosh. We're coming to the bow? We're going to the bow? No, no, no. Now she has fish. Keep that line tight. Rod tight. Rod bit. Come, you want to come up? She's running this way. No, it's not, much, not that much line out. Wow. Wow. A beast. Freaking beast, man. Come on, Sizzle. Night. Oh, oh she just had ducks. She swallowed that, dude. Can go straight up and down? Huh? Neck goes like this. Neck goes like this. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, dude. Brian. Look at that fish! Dude, that's like 45 inches! That's the biggest fish we've ever caught. She choked that freaking um, flare hawk. She choked it. How did she not fray you off? Where is it? Choked it. It's 40. She's 40. 40 okay. How deep? You can get the hooker and get that right out. It's in the bag. I'll get it. Here, hold this. Camera's on. Open that bail. Oh 
Nice. Oh my God. Look at that weird growth. Yeah, I know. Let's get back wow, in the water. Wow, that is the weirdest growth. Beast. Beast, beast, beast. <laughs> Look at this beast. She has a really oddly shaped weird growth on her lip. But uh, Brian is slinging these bad girls. Freaking huge female. She's a little skinnier now because she has actually gone through the spawn already, which is why she's way back in the river already. And they live here throughout the year. But that is a beautiful 40. We broke the 40 inch snook club today, guys. Well, Pudding did. And the two fish that I hooked this morning on top water seem to be a top water bite this morning. And then um, as the day is going on, oh my gosh, get my glasses. As the day is going on, seems like the bite is down deep. So I'm still throwing that top water. It's time to switch it up because pudding is showing me today. Now it's a competition. Gotta catch up. I think we should just go home. No. <laughs> okay, we're gonna, I'm gonna release Brian's fish and I'm excited to rig up my bait with the correct bait that is biting, well, that they're biting this afternoon. And this really weird lip sore is the weirdest thing I have ever seen in my life, but that's not from our hook. It's just like really gross. It almost looks like cancerous, like a tumor. It's really, really weird, but she's fine, obviously. And uh, she's a monster. She just spawned. So you, I actually, you can see she's like not as thick as that last fish was. Um, so she's removed all of her eggs, but she's still a beast. So her head is insane. Just going to make sure she's ready here. Take my time with Snook especially big, beautiful breeders like her. So crazy. Are you ready? As soon as she bites my finger, you can swim away. You ready? Fish is ready. She's kind of biting me lightly right now. She wants to take my finger down. All right, here we go. One, two, three. Beautiful. That was sick. So sick. I hope Brian filmed that release. That was so sick with her tail out of the water going back down. Super cool. All right, so it's two to zero and well, oh for two for me this morning. So let's see what I can make happen. I think it's time for me to have lunch, guys. Take a break. My day is done. 10.30. So, what? It's five o'clock somewhere, right? Land shark. All right, guys, back in the house, Darcy failed to catch any more fish. Yep. <laughs> Brian wouldn't let me. I wouldn't let her. But we got some special guests coming over. Do you guys remember Lisa and her daughter and it's our daughter's birthday? So we got yes. some gear. Ready? Here we go. Hi. 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 How are you? Oh my gosh, I'm you're wearing good. your bracelet. Yes. I, I thought do. you didn't like bracelets. Can I give you a I hug? do. Yes, you can. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. And she has the hat on. Look at your bow hat. Bracelet got tangled in my she hair. She loves land shark. <laughs> she's a big land shark got drinker? It. Well, she, she's to. not a drinker. She's, 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 she's the land shark <laughs> model. My, oh, it's it. a lifestyle okay. brand. It's a lifestyle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> How you doing? Strawberry Good, I'm fine. You know? so. yeah. <laughs> so like we were saying, it is Allie's 27th birthday and Lisa and Allie are great friends of ours. So we're going to hook them up with a bunch of dark sizzle stuff, land shark logger gear, all that good stuff. So might as well celebrate the birthday girl. So first things first, we're going to give her dark sizzle pink stickers. She loves pink. My fish hook and anchor bracelets. It's just a, a small assortment of them here. And of course I make these if you follow me for a long time. So description down below, check it out. But I'm going to let Lisa pick out one or two for herself. Ooh. I've got these bat, these really cool Sea Deck stickers that are adhesive. You can stick them to boats or cars and uh, Sea Deck makes these. They're actually available on their website for sale. Check them out, but they're super cool. Oh. Dar Sizzle shirts are also available on the website. Lots of merchandise guys for you guys to check out. <laughs> She's like loaded up with Dar Sizzle stickers <laughs> in the back of her truck. It's, it's so cute, I love it. So. She doesn't drink land shark. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, she, but she loves but wearing she it. But she loves wearing it. She That's is the awesome. apparel yeah, goddess. They give them this land shark bucket that they can put their goodies inside. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool. Yeah. And then a land shark towel. Which you've probably seen in my videos, but this is the newest towel version Good, that I came out with. Towel. Shirts. We can see if we have a size small. 
for Allie. Land Shark tank top. Sorry, guys, these are not available for sale. Um, Land Shark sent me all this gear. That Allie wore her last Land Shark law yeah. shirt and so much yeah. that she brought it out to me once about six months ago and said that she couldn't use it anymore because it was too worn. It needed to be shinier. <laughs> <laughs> so at that Allie long, is hooked up for her birthday. She's got her hands full. She can't even stand here like this. We gotta go put it in the truck. <laughs> yeah, and I'm gotta carrying go. the rest for her. So oh, no. they got I hooked up it. big time. She's I so excited. It. And it's awesome belly. to give away stuff like this. <laughs> I got it, I got it. I got it, I got it. I said get it back. <laughs> okay. I guess we could probably help Brian, but nah, it's well, too much I'm fun to work. The world got it. I'm a work. Another great day in the world, though, Sizzle. Long day. I got to slam some fish, and we got to give away some goods to some real nice folks. Yes. I'm very generous. Yes. Now, before we sign off here, I want to show you guys the rig I used, because I mentioned I would, I would talk about that a little bit in the video. Hold the camera, Sizzle. I'll be the model. You're the model, nice. All right, today, guys, so I used my Shimano Tranks bait caster, which I really like. This is a loose rod, it's like a bass rod. It's probably a, I can't read it because I have bad eyes, but it's a medium, Shimano medium. Shimano Tranks with a left hand reel. Yeah, should they see that? And this is what a flare hawk looks like. Okay, it's very standard snook bait for getting down deep under bridges and then spillways. And uh, this is a white one, they come in all different colors. And I got a 40 pound floral leader, which is a little bit light, but whatever. And then on here, I probably have 20 or 30 pound braid. I don't know. And I use a fancy FG knot. This is like 50 pound braid or 30. I don't know. She always got to argue with me. Whatever. And then I just want to say the rod. What kind of that rod is, is Yeah, I'm just going to say that it's a loose speed stick and it's a 7.3 medium heavy with a moderate action. Moderate action. All right. So it's a little bit of, I use it. It's kind of like my heavy stick for heavier baits and a little bit heavier lures. You can just see you spanked those big fish on that. No problem. Spank them. I do really well with this thing in salt water, as you might have seen. Yeah. He has become the flare hawk king. He has caught a bunch of fish on Quite flare hawks. Fish. I have yet to catch one. You also, also don't throw it as much. You also get to catch a fish today. I did not catch a fish today. <laughs> I, hooked three, I hooked two fish. That doesn't count. I have one both sides. That doesn't count. Reel the leader to the tip. That doesn't count. Kind of counts. No, that counts in a sailfish tournament, not in a snook Ew. tournament. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, let's sign off. If I didn't drop my reel in the water, we would have caught that fish. Excuses. I would have jumped in the water. But you didn't. Anyway. We would have made a viral video if we jumped. <laughs> but saying. I guess, guess you got to work on your YouTuber skills. Yeah. All right. Another great adventure. Until next time. Follow your dream and, and keep, keep on, on catching. catching. And everything we use is the Amazon store. Link down below. <laughs> <laughs>